Hello everybody, so I am going to do this as my Thursday video. Um, basically, I am a little hypomanic right now, and, um, you know, people talk about the, like, bursts of creativity they get when they are hypomanic or manic, and I have been doing lots of crafts, and of course staying up really late, it's like almost 5 o'clock, um, so I'm just going to show you what I've been doing for the last, like, four days. Um, so first off, this tray right here, um, it was wood, and, well, it is wood, it was, um, kind of an ugly wood color and I painted it black it's matte finished right now I'm not sure if I'm gonna gloss it over or not probably will and this buddy is a I guess you would say recycled two liter bottle it's a little cat and I made it shiny it's got these little um, fake crystals in it that go on the candle holder that I'm gonna show you that I um, painted and this is kind of the beginning of a flower that I made out of the bottom of a two-liter bottle just kind of experimenting and this is number two and this one is unfinished and I still need to gloss it over because it's matte and what I'm gonna do I made the lines thicker because I'm gonna draw um, black lines through the white this right here is the first time I've ever tried this um, so it's a little messed up and it's kind of not going to show up well on the uh, camera. But I basically um, put Mod Podge into this mason jar and then put some glitter in there and shook it around um, after gluing like a little heart that I had cut out of some cardboard. Glued it down and it kept the glitter from going on the heart mostly. And then it's got some little rocks in the bottom and then you put a fake candle in there. This right here, um, I still need some work on the lid um, to gloss it over, but I decided to make a 2014 Memories jar, so I painted black on the inside, um, and that's why it stayed shiny, and I used actually fabric paint, so it actually is raised up a little bit to do the writing. Um, this was just like a picture that I did, and it's really not how I would like it. I would like to heat this up, it's oil pastel, and then smear it with my finger, but you know, unfinished projects is one of those things. Um, this right here is all, except for this one, I haven't finished this yet, these are all handmade, or like homemade um, lip balms. I actually did, whoop, I actually did this one out of, let's see, focus, out of two Coke lids and a little bit of the plastic in between and when you open it up it just kind of looks like this color um, I'm one handed right now and I named it Rosie and so I used Carmex and um, some powder makeup that I had that I didn't use anymore it was like physician's formula and I think that was it on that one so it gave it a little bit of color it doesn't come through very well um, these two are the same um, I repurposed these containers. This was a blush and I used all of this, some more Physicians Formula, some chapstick and two lipsticks that I didn't like individually, mixed them together, heated them up and put them in here. And this is um, two medication bottles um, that I cut and super glued. Um, the bottom in here and haven't put anything in here yet. I don't know why my camera's not focusing, but um, you know, it could be for like another, like kind of repurposed lip balm. Ooh, focus. Um, you know, or what else, whatever else, like I was thinking about maybe doing a um, fire starter, putting some Vaseline on a cotton ball and sticking in there. Um, just, you know, whatever. So, um, this I just did. I just painted the inside like turquoise, did a couple coats, and just for like mental health um, positive self-talk, I decided to do this and what I'm going to do, oh, like what I'm doing with the memories jar, just putting, like writing on a sticky note, folding it, sticking it in there. Um, I want to try to put like something every couple days or, you know, just a couple times a week or whatever things that are positive about myself, like, you know, you're a kind person or something like that. Again, I just used the fabric paint, 
it's kind of a weird way that I said my name and it just says positive affirmations. This right here is like a glass container, um, sand in the bottom with some little seashells and a candle in the middle. And then these little stars are actually from a birthday party that we had this year um, for my memo and I. My birthday's um, the 15th of March and hers is the 17th of March, so we had like a joint birthday party at her church. Okay, and this right here is a candle holder. Um, just kind of decorative. It was like this ugly creamish color, I guess, creamish whitish color, and it just, you know, was dull and, you know, it was just kind of lackluster and, you know, looked old and stuff. So I painted it black, and this was incredibly hard to paint. I didn't spray paint it, I did it by hand. And once it was done today, I sprayed it with clear spray paint. Um, to cover it up and make it shiny. It's already dry. And then this right here is just another candle holder. It's a tall one. And I did the same thing. It was silver and I painted it black. I did a couple coats and then sprayed it today and made it shiny. So these are some of the, pro the projects that I have been working on. Just thought that I would share those with you. You know it is common with hypomania and stuff to do this. So just thought I would show you guys the results. Thank you for watching. If you are not a subscriber, oh, these little crystals, sorry. They, uh, there's these little, like, little loops under here. Oops, sorry. And they just hang there. And they go on off, like, there's like eight of them that go, like, in various places. They hang from here, too. Because I'm kind of using my kitchen. It's like a craft room right now. And we're packing and, you know, going to be moving, so, like, everything's just everywhere. So, pardon the mess. But, um, anyway, if you guys are not subscribed, please subscribe. And I will be keeping up with the videos. Um, to all of my subscribers, thank you so much. Thanks for watching this video. Um, please like and share and check out my other videos. And if you have any questions, I'm happy to answer them. And I hope all of you guys have a great, I guess, day. Because it's, you know... Almost five. All right. Bye-bye.